Okay, let's see. <laughs> okay, hold on. I'm getting, I'm getting everything set up here. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Second, second, second. Okay. <laughs> okay. Hello, everyone. I'm Mark, and I'm here with you for another live stream lesson. Yes, we are here for two hours together, you and me. We are going to be here for two hours. However, before I go any further, I need to know if you can see me <clears throat> and you can hear me. Please say yes in the comment stream. Well, already yes. Okay, fantastic. Good, good. I like, I like seeing that right away. Okay, thank you, Lolly, so much. Sleepwalker, Helga, hello, hello. Nur, hello, Nur. Yes, Nur's in the house. And um, <clears throat> Tomas is here. Great, Tomas is here. And um, let's see, all of our regular Fran is here. Nice, nice. Marion's here. Tetsuro, hello. Okay, great, great, great. Shire is here. All right, I'm really happy. Oh, Violet is here. Alisa is on time right now, on time. Hello, hello. Ella, Alice. Okay, great. <coughs> sorry, sorry about that. Um, all right, everyone. I am really happy to be here with you, of course. And like I was saying, we're going to be here for two hours. So I hope you are um, comfortable. I hope you are comfortable. I hope you are happy. I hope you are ready to practice your English with me for two hours. Yes, are you ready? Yes? Okay, good, because I'm ready also. <laughs> I'm here, I'm all ready now. Yes, I am. Okay, well, um, what we always, Ava, hello, Ava. Mwah, Ava. Um, what we always do is we have a toast for good luck. Yes, we do. We need a toast, and right here, I have my beverage right here, and it's filled with Mmm, it smells wonderful. It's hot coffee. So if you have a beverage, please pick it up for our toast, yeah? And of course, it's the green team, yeah? They're the supporters of the channel. So of course, we have to give them a special toast because they make it happen, right? They support me and the channel. And by supporting me and the channel, they are supporting everyone. So we have to give the green team a big, big thank you. All right. Cheers, green team. Yes, if you don't have a beverage, green team, let's bump fists. Here we go. Cheers, bump, cheers, bump. Yes, and let's have a drink together. Mm. It's hot, 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 hot. All right, now let's all have a toast to you as well. You are here. Without you, there's no reason for me to be here. So thank you for being here. Thank you for spending your precious time here with me. I really, really appreciate it. All right, so let's toast to you and a fun, interesting, productive, and motivating lesson today. Cheers. And if you don't have a beverage, fist bump. Cheers. Fist bump. Cheers. Fist bump. Okay, great. And because we had a toast, we have to have a drink. Mm. All right, all right. Now, now it's time to tell you about today's lesson, to give you today's lesson plan. All right, it's over there. You can't see it, but I can see it because it's off screen there. It's off screen, but I'm going to tell you what it is right now. <laughs> so, oh, first is hello. Oh, I didn't turn on a light. Ah, hold on. We need, there's a light here that did not go on. Now it's on. So there you go. It's a little brighter now. Yeah, okay, good, good. All right, so over there is today's lesson plan. And first it says, hello. Oh, that means I have to give you the official hello. Here, here is the official hello. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, wherever you are. Thank you for being here with, with me because without you, there's no reason for me to be here. So thank you. Mwah. Thank you for being here with me. <laughs> okay, good. Now for the activities we are going to do. Which one doesn't belong? I will give you four items, and within the four items, you tell me which one doesn't belong and why. Why, right? That's the most important thing is you tell me why. You have to 
think about the four things, you have to think about which one doesn't belong. And in English, tell me why you think that one thing doesn't belong with the other three. All right, so that is which one doesn't belong. Then after we do that, we are going to do dictation cards. I have dictation cards right here, and we will do three steps. Step one, I will read the card, and you will listen carefully and write down what I say word for word. Step two, we will shadow the cards. That is, we will speak. We will have speaking practice, and shadowing is when you speak at the same time as I do, like a shadow, right? Like a Here's my arm and there's the shadow against the whiteboard. As my arm moves up, my shadow moves up. As my arm moves down, my shadow moves down. So you will be my shadow. You will not repeat after me. You will speak at the same time. So you're using two skills. You're, you're using your listening skills and speaking skills at the same time. Yeah. Then step three, you will do it on your own. Yes, you will do it all by yourself. Okay. So again, for the dictation card, step one, you will listen and write down what I say word for word. Step two, we will shadow, that is have speaking practice. And then step three, you will do it all by yourself. Yes, that is dictation cards. Then after dictation cards, we will do Lolly's Revenge. And Lolly's Revenge is a conversation between two people, Joe and Sue, Joe and Sue. And there are four steps to Lolly's Revenge. Step one, I will read the conversation. Step two, I will ask you questions about the conversation. Step three, we will read the conversation together. And step four, we will shadow the conversation. So today, we're going to have lots and lots of practice. So I hope you are ready. Like I said, we're going to be here for two hours. So I hope you are comfortable. I hope you are happy. I hope you are ready to practice your English. <laughs> okay, that was the introduction. Oh, Maya is here. Hello, Maya. Good to see Maya. All right, Maya. Okay, so you could see the green team. They are strong. Yes, right there. I see them. Thank you uh, for your kind, kind support, green team. Yes, yes, yes. Okay, everyone. Rock on fire. How are you doing? Marginal voice is here. Okay, so we have our usual suspects are in the house. A tie. Hello, a tie. Okay, Great, great, great. Well, let's get right to it, shall we? Yeah? Okay, so let's do which one doesn't belong? Which one doesn't belong? Hello, I can't read Korean, so I don't know your name. So please tell me your name. Please help me by telling me your name. Okay. I, I know I can see that is Korean language, but I can't read it, so I can't say your name. Okay, well... We're going to do which one doesn't belong. I'm going to write it on the board. Which one, which one doesn't belong? Okay, and here's the first one. You're going to tell me which one and then why. Okay, so which one and why so like i said always i always say this um this is the most important because this is where you're using english you're thinking about the four things there are no wrong answers so it's whatever you think it is <laughs> but the 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 secret or the purpose is for you to explain in english yeah so this that's the challenge for you you have to explain your reason in English, all right? So that is your challenge. And because there's no wrong answer, it's up to your imagination, yeah? So I'm not looking for, like, one correct answer. No, it's whatever you want to say. It's however you think about it. So there's no wrong answer. But the challenge is you have to tell me in English, okay? So that, that is your challenge. And right here, I have the four items. Okay, are you ready? Yes? Okay, here, and I'm not, I'm not going to show you the pictures yet because I want you to listen and think about what I am saying, okay? <clears throat> if, I, if I told you what, if I showed you the picture right away, then it wouldn't be such a challenge for you, right? 
So it's a more of it's more of a challenge when you're listening and thinking about the four things and which one doesn't belong. So it makes it a little more challenge, challenging, but that's that's why we're here, right? That's why we're doing it. Um Maya says, Mark, your lesson is a time of pleasure. <laughs> How about a pleasurable time? How about that? So, Maya, Mark, your lessons are pleasurable. <laughs> or I'm having, I'm having a good time. How about that? So, time of pleasure, that, that's a little strange, Maya. Um, it's not so natural English there. I understand what you're saying, but... Um, it's better to say, oh, your, lesson, your lessons are pleasurable or I'm having um, a good time. I'm having, um, fun, I'm having a fun time. I'm having a good time. Your lessons are fun. Your lessons are interesting. I'm having a good time. Something like that. Okay. <laughs> Marcos. Hello, Marcos. Marcos is in the house. Okay, great, great. All right, let's, well, anyways, thank you, Maya. I appreciate, I appreciate you being here, Maya. I appreciate you being part of the green team. So I love you, Maya. You know that. You know I love you. So, so thank you for always being here. I really appreciate that. Okay, great, Maya. Okay, here we go. Let's do it. Are you ready, Maya? Yeah, are you ready? Okay, good. Is everyone else ready? Everybody ready? Yeah, okay, good. Here are the four things. A bra underpants, socks, sneakers. Which one doesn't belong and why? One more time. A bra, underpants, socks, sneakers. Which one doesn't belong and why? Which one doesn't belong and why? Here we go. One more time. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Violet's nervous. Why are you nervous, Violet? Violet, this is a comfortable... Um, we are, everyone here is, everyone is friendly, and this is a safe environment. This is a safe place. Violet, you don't need to be nervous, please. Oh, ha, ha. Say, so say, uh, say, oh, notice my red mug and my white mug. Well, this is my coffee mug, and this is my water mug. Coffee and water. Coffee and water. <laughs> so I like drinking both. I like, here's some coffee. Mm. And here's some water. Mm. So I like having both. Coffee and water. <laughs> okay, here we go. One more time. Oh, thank you, Rock on Fire. I appreciate that. Thank you for your kind, kind support. Okay, here we go. Which one doesn't belong? A bra underpants, socks, sneakers. Which one doesn't belong and why? Okay, we got people, we got people on the board right now. Okay, Helga, why? So that that's most important. You have to tell me the reason why. Okay, Tomas. Hello Tomas. How are you doing, Tomas? Tomas is on the board. Tomas, do you have your new computer now? Okay, Tomas. Sneakers, because there are not have direct contact to your body. No, no, no. Sneak sneakers. Sneakers. Like tennis shoes. Tennis shoes. Okay, sleepwalker. Sneakers, because it, they, okay, they are not underclothes. Okay, good. Good sleepwalker. So sneakers, so those are plural, right? So we say, Sneakers, um, because they are not under clothes. Because they are not under clothes. Yes, Violet. Good. Be, don't worry, Violet. Don't be nervous. Okay, Lolly says sneakers are not underwear. Okay, good. So underwear is, um, we, we use that as a singular form, okay? That's uncountable because there's different so lolly underwear has um it's kind of a big category right so underwear would be socks pants a slip right so underwear so that is singular because that is uncountable okay so 
um, underwear. Sneakers are not underwear. Okay, good. Marcos, sneakers because they are used outside the body. Yes. Helga, okay, sneakers because they are for our feet. Yes, yes, yes. A bra, and a bra is for our chest. Underpants are for <laughs> under our pants. Socks are for our feet. Go, socks go um, in our shoes, right? Okay, um, Fran says sneakers. They are for sports. They are for sports. Sleepwalker, because they are not under clothes. Good, good. They are. That's right. Sneakers, because um, there are two, right? One, one for your right foot and one for your left foot. There are two. Mary Poppins. Hello, Mary Poppins. Mwah! Good to see Mary Poppins. Sneakers, because they touch the ground. Oh, very interesting. Yeah. So remember, there are no wrong answers, just your imagination. That's great answer, Mary Poppins. Sneakers, because they touch the ground. A bra does not touch the ground. Underpants do not touch the ground. And socks, well, they can touch the ground if you don't wear shoes, right? <laughs> If you don't wear shoes, socks can touch the ground. Actually, I'm wearing socks, but no shoes. See? Let me, let me get my, can I get, oh, <laughs> oh no. <laughs> so I'm wearing socks, but not shoes. Because here in Japan, we do not wear shoes inside the house or in, inside like an office, right? So I have socks but no shoes because I live in Japan. We don't wear shoes inside. We don't wear shoes inside. Okay. Uh, okay, Ava. Let's see. Okay, Tomas. Okay, typo, no problem. Monica says sneakers because they are in the second layer. Okay, okay, Monica, interesting. They are, um, okay, that's interesting. Monica, I like that because um, like a bra, right? I don't, men, men don't wear bras, right? Bras are for women and the, a bra touches your skin. Underpants touches the skin. Uh, socks touches your skin, but not sneakers, right? So they are the second layer. Yeah, I like that. So your first layer would be your bra, your underpants, and your socks. The second layer would be maybe a shirt, pants or shorts, sneakers. Very good. Yeah, Monica, I like that. Nice answer, Monica. Okay, um, Aisha, I don't understand. Please explain. Aisha, so I'm telling you about four things. I'm giving you four things, and in the four things, uh, or amongst the four things, which one doesn't belong with the other three, right? So, for example, we have a bra, underpants, socks, and sneakers. Of the four things, right, one doesn't belong. And so some people say sh um, sneakers because they touch the ground, right? Others, people have said, um, has it been sneakers all the way? Okay, now see, Lolly says bra because you don't have to write it in plural. That's good, see? So that's another answer, right? So um, bra has no S, does not have a plural. Underpants has an S, has a plural. Socks has an S, has a plural. Sneakers has an S, has a plural, but not bra. So, so very good. So that's how we play the game. Yeah, that's how we play the, let me see who, hold on, I need to. So that was um, Aisha. So that, that is the game. That's what we're doing. Okay, Ava, socks, because we use, we use them um, with shoes. Okay, Ava, socks, because we use them with shoes. Good, good, good. Um, Violet says sneakers because they are not under clothes. Good. Hashem. Bra because it's used for top body. Yes. Underpants, socks, sneakers are lower body. 
Bra is the upper body. Very good. It's great answers. There's no wrong answer. You guys are all doing great. Maya, um, pa underpants because we can't go without it outside. No, no, no. Maya, underpants. Oh, there are things we don't need. <laughs> yes, yes. Okay, good. But Maya, not pants, underpants. 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 So you don't want to go outside with only underpants. <laughs> Maybe Maya people would like, wait, that, that, she's crazy. That, that woman's crazy. She's outside in only her underpants. <laughs> she's only walking around in underpants. Someone will call the police on you, Maya. So be careful or you will go to the police station. <laughs> okay, yeah, okay, so... Lolly likes using the alphabet, so she's playing with the letters, playing with spelling. Socks because there is no A in socks. Yes, bra has an A, underpants has an A, sneakers have an A, but socks do not have an A. No, 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 no. Okay, Ida, that's my answer. So Ida, that is my, so Ida has my answer. Um, bra because it's used for women. So that's my, that's my answer. Uh, Tomas, because, uh, because of the bra hook, getting nervous, Ava. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> uh, okay, Ava, um, bra because has, has two or more hooks. Uh, in the back, a hook. Okay. But now there's like um, training or sports bras, right? Where like you put them on with, out hooks, right? Like a sports bra, kind of like underpants. Okay. Okay, Helga, all other things are unisex. Yes, that is, that is my answer. Good, Helga. <laughs> okay, I'm confused. Don't, it's okay, Maya, you're, don't be confused. Okay, um, yeah, okay, so good, good. Okay, so let's let's go on to the next one. So yeah, so I I had bra because bra because um it's used with women. Okay, so so bra is used with women and then all the others unisex right the others like underpants socks sneakers so those are for everyone where a bra is used for women well the jets are flying right now okay let's go around to everyone nice 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 okay yeah okay rock on fire yep good but th there's really no wrong answer everyone i like i like the sneak i like um Monica, Monica put, um, she said that sneakers because they touch the ground. I thought, oh, that's very, that's a great answer. Okay, two. Okay, okay, because, because, because. Okay, here we go. Oh, Larissa, hello, Larissa. Mwah. Good to see Larissa. Okay, now. Okay, good. All right. Are you ready for our next group? Here we go. Here's our next group. Which one doesn't belong? <clears throat> Here we go. A fork, a wheelbarrow, a shovel, and a trash can. Which one doesn't belong and why? Here we go. One more time. A fork, a wheelbarrow, a shovel, a trash can. Which one doesn't belong and why? Here we go, one more time. A fork, a wheelbarrow, a shovel, and a trash can. Which one doesn't belong? A fork, a wheelbarrow, a shovel, a trash can. Which one doesn't belong and why? Which one doesn't belong and why? Oh, okay. Um, Arizal says socks and pants for football. 
sneakers too, right? Sneakers, you need, you need sneakers to play soccer or play football. Um, Danya, hello, Danya. Okay, um, Arizo, why fork? So you have to tell me the reason why. You have to say why. That's the, that's the purpose here. I want you to use your English. It's a challenge, right? You have to explain why in English. You have to give the reason in English. That's challenging, right? Okay, Helga says, uh, trash can because it is not for eating. Okay, well, okay. <laughs> let, let me say, okay, I have to tell you the, the things again, Helga, okay? So listen to the four things again. A fork, a wheelbarrow, wheelbarrow, a shovel, and a trash can. Sleepwalker, trash can because it's outside the house. Okay, Aida says, I do not know two of these words. Okay, that's th no problem. I'm going to explain. Oh, Bono. Okay, Bono. Good, good. Okay, Bono. Why don't you change, put your, put, why Arizo? Put Bono there. Then I know you. <laughs> then I know it's you, Bono. Okay, yeah, and. And um, Hashem, I Hashem, I didn't see Hashem. Is he here today? Okay, Tamas says, I don't know these words. Okay, I'm going to tell you. I'm not going to show you. I want to explain to you, okay? Okay, fork, we know a fork, right? Um, we use a fork in the kitchen when we're eating. We use a fork. A wheelbarrow has a tire in the front, one tire, and you pick it up and you move things with it. It has like a, a barrel. That's why we say wheelbarrow. It's like a barrel with, with a tire and two handles. And you pick it up and you, you move it, okay? Wheelbarrow. And then a shovel has a handle and there's like a scoop on the end and we use it for digging, right? If you, if you need to make a hole in the ground, we use it for digging a hole. Uh, we use it for moving um, dirt, okay, or maybe leaves, things like that. So we have wheelbarrow, shovel, trash can, fork. Okay. Okay, rock on fire. Here we go. One more time. A fork, a wheelbarrow, a shovel, and a trash can. Which one doesn't belong and why? Yeah, later I will show you the pictures. But right now I want you to think hard and do it by yourself. Okay, a wheelbarrow. We can pick it up. There's, there's a tire in front. And then there's a barrel like a... a, like a, a um, container right it's like a container and then with two handles so we can put it down and put things in it and then when we need to move it we pick it up and we can move it and we can move heavy things with it right so we, it could be very heavy and we can still move it wheelbarrow and a shovel is when you want to um, dig a hole in the ground you use a shovel and you know trash can, you put your trash in there. And a fork, you, you eat food with a fork. Okay. Lolly says, fork because it's not a container. Yes, nice, nice. Oh, there's Hashem. Hashem's here. Okay. Shovel because it uses, it's used for removing snow. Shovel because it's used for removing snow. A shovel because it's used for removing snow. Very good, Hashem. Okay, now you get it. Okay, Maya. <laughs> okay, Larissa. Um, a fork because it's small. Very good. Yeah. Good, Larissa. So many answers. Uh, there's no wrong answer. Your imagination. 
Difficult words, Fran. Okay, here we go. One more, to one more time, Fran. A fork, a wheelbarrow, wheelbarrow, a shovel, and a trash can. Fork, okay, Hashem. Fork, because it's used in the kitchen. Very good. It's used in the kitchen. Ida, fork, because we use it for eating. Yes. Lamp. Poo, hello. Lolly, fork because it's used for eating. Marginal voice, a fork because it is related to eating. Okay, I die. Now I know all the words. Good. Okay. Um, Ayesha, why a fork? So I want you to tell me why a fork. Okay, Amna, a fork doesn't belong because it takes, because it's a lit, because it's small. A fork doesn't belong because it's small. Okay, Amna, a fork doesn't belong because it's small. Okay, you're confused, Judy, that's okay. You will understand. Now, I'm telling you four things, and of the four things, which one doesn't belong with the other three? And our four things are? A fork, a wheelbarrow, a shovel, and a trash can. And um, so, for example, Ava says wheelbarrow because it has a wheel, right? Where a fork does not have a wheel. A shovel does not have a wheel. A trash can does not have a wheel. So wheelbarrow doesn't belong, okay? So understand? Very good, Ava. Sleepwalker. Fork because... It's an almost weightless thing. <laughs> it's almost weightless. Very, very light. Very good. Very good. Um, okay, so Korea, why fork? So I need to know why. Because, because, because. Monica, wheelbarrow, because the others can be loaded on it. Mm. Monica, you are very smart. Monica has a very, um, I want to say, big imagination, or Monica's very clever. Yes, Monica's very clever. Monica said wheelbarrow because we could put all the other things in the wheelbarrow, right? We could put the fork, we could put a fork in a wheelbarrow. We can put a shovel in a wheelbarrow. We can put a trash can in a wheelbarrow, but... We cannot put a wheelbarrow in a trash can because a wheelbarrow does not fit in a trash can. We cannot put uh, we cannot put a fork. You can't put anything in a fork. You can't put it, a shovel. You put dirt in a shovel. You can put the fork in a shovel, but you can't put the trash can in the shovel. You can't put the wheelbarrow in the shovel. No. So great answer, Monica. Very good. Okay, um, Violet, fork because it's used for eating. Very good. Larissa, hello, Larissa. Mwah, good to see Larissa. Maya says, a fork because it has prongs. Yes. Very good. There's no wrong answers. So a fork has usually what, like four prongs or something like that, right? And so it's used for, for stabbing, stabbing food, right? Where a uh, shovel has no prongs uh, a trash can has no prongs a wheelbarrow has no prongs that's right okay good 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 ava says a uh, fork because i can pick someone you can prick someone you can prick someone oh ava don't do that don't do that ava hashem wheelbarrow because it's used for moving things yes Good, Hashem. Very good. Marginal voice. A wheelbarrow because it has it has a wheel. It's got a wheel. Marcos, um, a fork can be used for hay. Okay, that's Marcos. That's a pitchfork. So the big ones, right? That for hay, we say pitchfork. P I T um, T C H F O R K. Pitchfork. Pitch. And those are big, and that's for the hay, pitchfork. But I said fork, a fork. So that's what we use in the kitchen. 
Okay. Uh, okay. Okay, okay. Let's see. Sleepwalker uh, fork. We can use other things for work. Um, trip, take away, throw away. Drip, take away, throw away. Yes. Okay, Tetsuro. Uh, no problem. Yes, Tomas, pitchfork. Good. I will give you the answer. I, I mean, I will. There's. They're, all the answers are good. I'm going to show you the picture soon, okay? Um, Ida says trash can because we do not move anything with it. Um, but with fork, we move food. With shovel, we move sand and soil. And with wheelbarrow, we move different things. Ida, that, look at everybody. Ida, great, great answers. Everyone can see. Um, great help for everyone. Very good, Ida. Very good. Nice, nice, nice. Okay, now for my answer. <laughs> my answer was um, fork because um, it doesn't hold things, right? So, okay, fork because it doesn't. Hold things. Okay, so so it, it 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 like it it stabs, right? So a fork. So a fork stabs. Right? So so it 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 so here, let's say we have a, a piece of um, steak. Uh, bad picture. So let's say we 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 have a um, and so the fork is going to go inside, right? So it's going to stab where where the wheelbarrow it holds, right? It holds like for example, Ida. Perfect, Ida. You know. Um, that's my answer, right? Okay, so trash can because it. Okay, well, okay. I so um, you put things into a trash can. A trash can holds trash, right? Um, a shovel holds soil and snow, things like that, right? And then a wheelbarrow holds um, maybe dirt or whatever you want to put in. Like if you're cleaning, if you're cleaning your yard, you put like the weeds inside. You put the leaves. You put you could put dog poo in there, whatever. Um, so whatever you're cleaning up, you put it in the wheelbarrow, and you could just move it to another place easily. Okay, so that's my answer. Fork because it doesn't hold things; it stabs things. It just stabs things. Okay, now okay, let's do one more. This is the last one. Okay, here we go. This is round three. Okay, which one doesn't belong and why? Because. Okay, here we go. Here we go. All right. Here are the four things. Are you ready? Oh, that's okay. You didn't. I'm going to show you the pictures, okay? I'm going to show you the pictures so you're going to be able to see everything and then you should understand. Um, what they are by the pictures, okay? So right now, you maybe it's difficult for you right now because you don't have an, a picture of the thing, right? You, you can't see it, right, in your mind. In your head, in your mind, you can't see it, so it's difficult, okay? But that's okay because after we finish this number three, I'm going to show you all the pictures, okay? Here we go. Which one doesn't belong? We're at round three. And here we go. A playing card. A die. A chess piece. And a roulette wheel. Okay, one more time. A playing card. A die. A chess piece. A roulette wheel. Which one doesn't belong and why? Here we go, one more time. A playing card. A die. A chess piece, 
a roulette wheel. Which one doesn't belong and why? Hello, F Fatma. Fatima. <laughs> okay, friend. HB. Hello, HB. How you doing? <laughs> HB's in the house. Sunflower. Hello, Sunflower. Sunflower's in the house. Yeah, sale. That's better. A fort because it doesn't contain something. It can't. It cannot contain um, anything. It cannot contain anything. Very good. Yeah, that's better. I like hold things. I put hold things. Contain things. That's that's better. Contain things. Good, good, good. Contain. I like. Yeah, that's a better than hold. Contain. Because it doesn't contain things. Or it can't, it can't contain things. Yeah, like, thank you, Sale. That's better. It cannot contain things. Okay, good, 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 good. Okay, Sleepwalker, a die because it doesn't connect with games. It does. A die, no, 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 no. D-I-E. Not, 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 not die, not um, color die. The game piece die. D-I-E. So dice. So two is two, plural, dice. One is die. Okay? So... Um, plural, two, two are called dice. One is called die. D-I-E. Okay. Lolly says, playing cards because they are made of paper. Yes, yes, very good, very good. Okay, Ava, um, play cards because it's made from paper. Yes, good. Alice, Okay, words you don't know. Okay, that's okay. Um, a playing card, right? Like um, they have numbers on it, right? Each card has, a, like we have um, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, jack, queen, king, ace. Okay, those are playing cards. Um, a die or dice, two or dice, and those have um, numbers, right? Um, six, six, um, six ends, right? So you have number one through six. Those are, that's a die one. Chess, right? The game chess and roulette wheel has numbers and they're black and white and they, it spins around and you put a little ball in there and then when it stops, the ball stops on a number. That's a roulette wheel. Okay, Lolly, roulette wheel because it makes me think of money. <laughs> All of it on number six. Let's go number six. Yes, yes. <laughs> I went. I went black. I went red. Yes, yes, yes. Okay. So one more time. Which one doesn't belong? A playing card. A die. A chess piece. A roulette wheel. Which one doesn't belong? Okay, Tomas, I only know chess and roulette. Playing card. They have, it's two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Um, jack, king, queen, ace. Playing cards. And dice, one die. You throw it and a number comes up. You throw it, oh, that's a number four. Oh, that's a number five. Oh, that's a number one. Marcos, a chess piece because um, it is used only for battle. <laughs> ah, see, Lolly's always got the good answers. Roulette wheel because it's round, yes. Helga, why roulette wheel? Please tell me why. Hashem, die because it doesn't use for playing. No, 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 no. 
it is used for playing. So remember, dice, there's two. Die, there's one, and we use those for playing. Okay. <laughs> okay, hold on. I will show you the, uh, you will see the pictures soon, Tomas. Roulette wheel, because we play it in a casino. Okay, Ava, chess piece, because it's only for two people. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Very good. That's a good one, Ava. A chess piece, because it's only, only two people play chess. Very good. I like it. That's very good. Yes. Playing cards, we could play up to like, you know, six people, eight people, three people, right? A roulette can be, many people can play that. Um, dice, many people can play that. But chess, only two people. Very good. Okay. Um, Tomas, a, a die. So D-I-E. A die. D-I-E. Okay, Lolly. Playing cards because there is not an E in it. There is no E. Yes, die has an E. Chess has an E. Roulette wheel has an E. A couple there. Yes, yes, yes. Okay. Monica, you got, that's my answer. Monica, th is he, this is your first time here, isn't it, Monica? Okay, yes. <laughs> that's my answer, Monica. Very good. Okay, Ella, chess piece because it isn't for playing at casino. Yes, my, that's what, good, Ella, yeah. So um, chess, right? Because it's, it, it's not for, for um, betting. We don't use in a casino, right? So um, chess, because it's not played in a casino. It's not played in a casino. Yeah, 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 yeah. Very good, very good. Okay. So here are, here are the pictures, okay? So we did two last time, okay? So the new ones here are the, okay, let's, here, here they are. Here they are. I got to move my, okay. So we did, okay, so this is our first round. We have a bra, underpants, socks and sneakers and we said bra because it's only used with women underpants socks and sneakers are unisex and then here we have a fork right there we have a fork a wheelbarrow a shovel and trash can and we said fork because a fork cannot contain things right where a wheelbarrow we put things in a wheelbarrow a shovel right put things in a shovel and a trash can we put things in a trash can and then here we go our playing card there's the die chess piece and roulette wheel and we use playing cards in a casino we use um, dice in a casino roulette wheel in a casino but not a chess piece we don't play chess in a casino okay very good and then last week we did remember we did the the safety pin, padlock, scissors, thumbtack, and we did tank top, t-shirt, shorts, and pants. We did those last time. Okay, very good, everyone. Very good. Okay, everyone understands? Chess because it has no numbers on it. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's, see, there are many answers. I like that. Good marginal voice. There, yeah, HB, so chess is not played in casino. That's right. Oh, sleepwalker, roulette wheel, um, because it's a fast game. That's right. So there are many, many answers, just only your imagination. So everyone did great. Um, I like this game because 
there are no wrong answers, right? So it's just your imagination. You have to think about the items, right? You have to think about the four things, right? Like here, we, you know, for example, playing card, die, chess, roulette. You have to think of these things. You have to think about the relationship and which one, which three go together, which three are used together, and which one isn't, right? So there's no wrong answers. It's just your imagination. So um, it's a great game. I like it. I like it. And I like your answers. And from your answers, I could understand you better, right? Because um, it's kind of like your personality, right? So you're, you're using your, your critical thinking skills. You're using your imagination. And that reflects onto your personality. So even though I can't see your face, um, we could, I can't hear your voice, um, I can't touch you, right? But I can see your, your writing, and here, this game, I can see your personality. So by doing this game, I can understand you better. I can, um, I, I can, I could, um, understand you better. I could, um, I could, I can know you better, right? So I like this game because you have to use imagination and I can um, learn about m more of you, right? I can learn more about you. So, so I like it, I like it. <laughs> now I know um, how it looks a die. So one, right? Okay, so we say one die and two dice. D-I-C-E. So two, we say dice. One, we say die. Okay, so a die and then dice. Two. Okay, good, good, good. Nice, nice. Okay, nice. Okay, Fran says chess because you have, you need a big strategy. Yeah, Fran. Where, but Playing cards strategy too. I think, of course, um, dice or a die, it's all luck. Um, a roulette is all luck. But um, chess is skill, right? You need strategy. You need a skill. And I think cards too. Cards, same thing. Um, you need a strategy. It's skill, right? I mean, there's some luck, right? Of course, there's lots of luck. But um, there is some skill, right? That's right. Okay, so Lolly. Thank you, Lolly. See, Lolly wrote, okay, one die, two dice. One die, two dice. One die, two dice. Ida, your class is really pleasurable. Thank you. Thank you, Ida. Okay, let's go to our next activity, yeah? Okay, let's go to our next activity, which is... Um, dictation cards. Yep. Oh, oh, I'm going to take a picture of the whiteboard first, though. And I'm going to put, I'm going to put this picture on the whiteboard. So I'm going to take a picture of this, of the paper, and this. So you can go and check it out anytime you want to, okay? Just go to my Facebook group page, Mark Kulik English Speaking Practice, and you can check it out anytime you want to. Okay, so we got the, I got all the pictures here, and then here is how we played the game. So I'm going to take a picture, and um, after today's lesson, I will upload it to my Facebook group page, Mark Kulik English Speaking Practice, so that way you can check it out anytime you want to. Okay, I'm stepping back to take the picture. Okay, here we go. <coughs> Countdown, four, three, two, one. Okay, I got the picture. All right, all right. And um, after today, I will upload this to my Facebook group page. But right now, we are going to do dictation cards. So you need a pencil and a piece of paper. You need a pencil and a piece of paper. 
and we will do three steps. Step one, <coughs> you will listen and write down what I say word for word. Step two, you, we will shadow the cards. And step three, you will do it by yourself. By yourself. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, and today's topic is superlatives. That, is that what we're doing today? Superlatives. Yeah. Okay. So superlatives is adjectives when we're comparing things and um, it's the top, right? And so it's at the top. So superlatives. Okay, the top. Okay, and so, and we add a um, EST. Okay, so, so, um, for example, Whoops, the most famous. Oh, and then, um, and then we have irregular. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. So, let's see. Okay, so here, okay, so big, and then we, with big, there's a G, so we have to add another G. So big, the biggest. So actually, we should put the. Okay. Okay, so, okay, so with the B, we add a B, biggest, tall, we just add the EST, the tallest. So when you're talking of a group, and in the group, the, the top in the group, okay? The top in the group. The top in the group. Okay, so when, you when you're comparing a group of things, okay? And the top is, we put the EST, okay? So the tallest, famous. So here, there are famous. There's more famous. So there, there are three or two fa famous. So there's two um, syllables. So we need most, okay? The most famous, the most famous. Happy. There's a Y, so we change the Y to a I in EST. Happiest, the happiest. And these are irregular, so good is the best, bad is the worst. Okay? So this is basically the rules, right? We, for, with the G, we put, add another G. With the S, the biggest. Uh, tall, just one syllable, so it's the tallest. Famous has two syllables, so. Um, we have to put a most, the most famous. Happy, um, we, it has a Y, so we change the Y to an I. 
and becomes happiest. And these are irregular. So good becomes the best. Bad becomes the worst. Okay, good, 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 good. <laughs> oh, no, Lolly, you're the nicest. <laughs> you're the top of the group. You're the nicest. You're the smartest. Lolly is the smartest. So Lolly is the top of the group. She's the smartest. Okay, good, good, good. All right. Um, <laughs> okay, let, let's do it, okay? Dictation time, all right? So you need a pencil. You need a piece of paper. This is step one. I want you to write down what I say word for word. And... I'm only going to say these three times, okay? And I'm not going to say them more than three times, all right? So you have to listen carefully. You have to write down what I say. However, round two, we will shadow and I will show you the card. You will see the sentence. You will see the picture in round two. Then round three, you're going to do it by yourself, okay? So round one, I'm only, only going to read the card three times and you're not going to see the picture you can't no 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 you can't you have to listen and write down what i say word for word and i'm only going to say only three times okay after three times next card okay i'm going to say this card three times one two three sentence one two three and then the next card and then the next card you can't see the cards but in round two we will shadow and then i will show you the card okay all right ready sleepwalker is ready lolly is ready okay here we go here we go let's do it two here's time for shadowing okay let's count down five four three two one here we go card number one this was the best donut I have ever eaten. Second time. This was the best donut I have ever eaten. Three. This was... The best donut I have ever eaten. Two. Card number two. You are the worst driver I have ever seen. Second time. You are the worst driver I have ever seen. Third time. You are the worst driver I have ever seen. Card number three. This is the longest I have ever waited. Second time. This is the longest I have ever waited. Third time. This is the longest I have ever waited. Card number four. This is the biggest race in my life. Second time. This is the biggest race in my life. Third time. This is the biggest race in my life. Card 
card number five. This is the fastest roller coaster in the park. This, this number two, second time, second time. This is the fastest roller coaster in the park. Good, Tetsuro. Okay, third time. This is the fastest roller coaster in the park. Card number six. Card number six. This might be the most famous painting in the world. Second time. This might be the most famous painting in the world. third time this might be the most famous painting in the world number card number seven card number seven sleepwalker Right, sleepwalker. Number seven, card number seven. I'm the happiest I've been in a long time. Ava! <laughs> you get the cards, Ava. The cards are yours. Hold on, I need to finish this one card. Okay, Ava, hold on. Wait, wait, Ava. Now put your name. Thank you, Ava. Mwah, thank you so much. Thank you, thank you. Okay, second time. I'm the happiest I've been in a long time. Third time. I'm the happiest I've been in a long time. Ava, thank you. I love you, Ava. Thank you for your kind, kind support. Ava's on the board. Yes, Ava. I love you, Ava. Thank you so much. And she gets the cards. I will send Ava the cards. If you want the cards, you send a super sticker like Ava did, and I will put your name, and then I will send you these cards. So, so thank you so much for your kind support, Ava. Mwah, thank you so much. <clears throat> okay, here we go. Card number eight, last card, last card. Here we go, last card. This is the tallest mountain I have ever climbed. Good, Tomas. Second time. This is the tallest mountain I have ever climbed. Ava, Mwah. third time. This is the tallest mountain I have ever climbed. Sleepwalker, very good, Sleepwalker. Nicely done. Okay. So a little difficult today, everyone. Yeah, these are a little difficult. All right, but most of you guys are doing good. You're doing good, and it's a challenge, and it's good practice for you, yeah? So, um, okay, let's go round two, okay? Round one, you, you didn't see the cards, right? You're, you listened only three times, right? I said each card only three times. Then you wrote down what I said, right? So now we are going to shadow. Okay, I'm going to, now we're going to practice speaking these cards. Then I will show you the cards. You will see the sentences. 
you will see the meaning, okay? You will see the picture, which will give you the context, and also the words will um, tell you the meaning, okay? And then we'll talk about each card, and then, um, and then you will do it by yourself, okay? So let's, let's do shadowing now. So this is speaking practice, okay? Here we go. Count down. Five, four, three, two, one. Okay, let's speak together. Speak at the same time as I do, okay? Let's do this at the same time. Here we go. This was the best donut I have ever eaten. This was the best donut I have ever eaten. This was the best donut I have ever eaten. This was the best donut I have ever eaten. Okay, how'd you do? So we, you know the meaning, right? So it's like, oh, this was the best. Oh, I have never eaten a better donut, right? This was the best, right? All the other donuts before were not as good as this one. <laughs> okay, card number two. You are the worst driver I have ever seen. You are the worst driver I have ever seen. You are the worst driver I have ever seen. <laughs> you are the worst driver I have ever seen. You are the worst driver I have ever seen. So this driver so the person, you are, like, I have never seen anyone who drives worse than you, right? You are the worst. <laughs> okay, card number three. Yes, I have ever eaten. So, Ava, yes, this was the best donut I have ever eaten. Saber. This was the best donut I have ever eaten. Yes, good, good, good. Okay, number three, number three. You are the worst driver I have ever seen. Yes, Hashem. <laughs> okay, Violet, you are the worst driver I have ever seen. Good, good. Donuts are too sweet for me. Okay, good. Tom Tomas, donuts are too sweet for me. Okay, yeah, Saber. Okay, good. Okay, card number three. This is the longest I have ever waited. 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 Okay, so they're at the airport and they're waiting for their plane. Okay, they're waiting to board the plane. And so of all the times they've been to the airport, all the times they have been on an airplane, this is the longest time they've had to wait. Like time, the longest time, right? Like, oh, we're, our plane is five hours late, right? It's like, wow, this is the longest I have ever waited. This is the longest I have ever waited. Okay, card number four. This is the biggest race in my life. This is the biggest race in my life. This is the biggest race in my life. No problem, Tomas. Me too, Ava. I hate waiting. I hate it. It's the worst. <laughs> waiting is the worst, huh, Ava? Waiting is the worst. Esther, hello, Esther. This is the longest I have ever waited. Good, Esther. This is the biggest race in my life. So here, like, this means like most important, right? So the biggest race, or we can say the most important, okay? 
this is the biggest opportunity. This is the most important opportunity. So this means the same thing. So um, the biggest race, the most important. This is the biggest race in my life. All right, good, good. Okay, card number five. Yes, the worst. Waiting is the worst. Yes, Ava. Okay, card number five. This is the fastest roller coaster in the park. This is the fastest roller coaster in the park. This is the fastest roller coaster in the park. This is the fastest roller coaster in the park. This is the fastest roller coaster in the park. Okay, so in the in the amusement park, there are different roller coasters, and this one is the fastest of all the roller coasters in the park. Okay, number six. Oh, Sleepwalker, this was the best donut I have ever eaten. You are the worst driver I have ever seen. This is the longest I have ever waited. This is the biggest race in my life. Okay, good. Yeah, nice one, Sleepwalker. Okay, number six. Six, yes. This might be the most famous painting in the world. This might be the most famous painting in the world. This might be the most famous painting in the world. Which one's that? Which one's that? There's a quiz, everyone. What do you think? Which painting do you think this is? Okay? So this might be the most famous painting in the world. What painting is that? So please tell me in the please tell me in the comment what what painting this is. Okay? This might be the most famous painting in the world. Please tell me in the comment. What do you think? Uh-oh, Seo says, I really don't like roller coasters. <laughs> Me too. <laughs> okay, Lolly, Picasso, but which, which painting? So, for example, um, Tomas says, Mona Lisa. Picasso is an artist, right? So, which painting? So, this painting, this, this might be the most famous painting in the world. Which one is that, do you think? Um, Geronica. I don't know, Ida. I don't know that painting. Okay, Helga, another Mona Lisa. Monk. Okay, which Picasso? Van Gogh, which, which painting? Michelangelo is not a painting. Michelangelo is a statue. Maya, Mona Lisa. Cry of Monk. Guernica. I'm not sure how, I don't know, I don't know what Guernica, I don't know that. Maybe if I saw it, another Mona Lisa. Wow, okay, so we got the last, actually we say the last supper. Tomas. The Last Supper, not dinner, The Last Supper. Okay, so everyone's, we got lots of Mona Lisa, and here we go. This might be the most famous painting in the world. Oh, ah, Van Gogh's Sunflower. Yep, that's a, I like the sun, yep. Okay, we got some, we got Mona Lisa, we got some sunflowers here. We got The Last Supper. Okay, Cry of Monk. Oh, it's Picasso. I'm not sure how to pronounce it. Ger Guernica. Guernica. I'm not sure. Picasso, he's Spanish, right? He's from Spain, right? Picasso. Okay. Ah, about the, the Spanish Civil War. Okay. Last Supper. Ah, okay. 
Guernica, is it, I'm not sure how to pronounce it, I'm, I'm probably pronouncing it wrong, is a town the Germans bombed. Okay. I'm sure I've seen it, but I don't know the name of it. Okay, we have a question. What's the difference between dinner and supper? No difference. <laughs> um, y yeah, they, they, same meaning, both. And the, the, the last supper, right? So Tomas said dinner. It, um, supper, same meaning, but I think the name of the painting is the last supper. At least in, in English, that's the name in English. Black square. Okay. Fugaku, 36K. Hakusai. Hakusai. I don't know. Yeah, okay. I don't know. But yep, okay. It's the Mona Lisa. <laughs> Okay, so this might be the most famous painting in the world, the Mona Lisa. <laughs> okay, good. Okay, okay, let's go. Card number seven. I'm the happiest I've been in a long time. I'm the happiest I've been in a long time. I'm the happiest I've been in a long time. I'm the happiest I've been in a long time. I'm the happiest I've been in a long time. Okay, and card number eight, last card. This is the tallest mountain I have ever climbed. Yes, I do. Of course, Tomas, I know the Last Supper. Of course, of course. This is the tallest mountain I have ever climbed. This is the tallest mountain I have ever climbed. This is the tallest mountain I have ever climbed. Okay, good, good, good. All right, now it's your turn, yeah? So I have a blank piece of paper here, and then I'm going to cover and so I want you to say the sentence by yourself. Okay, we'll do it together and then by yourself. Together, then by yourself. Together, then by yourself, okay? So I want you to say these sentences all by yourself, okay? Here we go. First, we'll do this together. This was the best donut I have ever eaten by yourself. This was the best donut I have ever eaten. This was the best donut I have ever eaten. This was the best donut I have ever eaten. Larissa, you got the cards, Larissa. Yes, you got them. Mwah. Larissa wants the cards and she's got them. Thank you, honey. <coughs> oh, <coughs> Larissa, I love you. Thank you always, always for your wonderful support. You got the cards. Yes. Thanks so much. Mwah. You got it. You got it. I'll send them off when I finish today's lesson. You got it. You got it. Okay. Now, Larissa and Ava, this is time to, I want you you say it all by yourself. I want you to say them all by yourself. This was the best donut I have ever eaten. This was the best donut I have ever eaten. This was the best donut I have ever eaten. Okay, here we go. Next card. You are the worst driver I have ever seen. You are the worst driver I have ever seen. You are the worst driver I have ever seen. You are the worst driver I have ever seen. 
You are the worst driver I have ever seen. You are the worst driver I have ever seen. You are the worst driver I have ever seen. Okay, here we go. Third card. This is the longest I have ever waited. 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 Okay, here we go. Next card. This is the biggest race in my life. 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 Yeah, that some cards are that way. Yeah, Helga. Yeah. Okay, next card. This is the fastest roller coaster in the park. This is the fastest roller coaster in the park this is the fastest roller coaster in the park this is the fastest roller coaster in the park this is the fastest roller coaster in the park is the fastest roller coaster in the park. This is the fastest roller coaster in the park. Okay, our next card. This might be the most famous painting in the world. This might be the most famous painting in the world. This might be the most famous painting in the world. This might be the most famous painting in the world. This might be the most famous painting in the world. This might be the most famous painting in the world. This might be the most famous painting in the world. Okay, our card number seven. I'm the happiest I've been in a long time. I'm the happiest I've been in a long time. I'm the happiest I've been in a long time. I'm the happiest I've been in a long time. I'm the happiest I've been in a long time. I'm 
the happiest I've been in a long time. I'm the happiest I've been in a long time. Okay, good. And our last card. Here we go. No, Lolly. <laughs> not even close. <laughs> not, not even close, Lolly. <laughs> okay. This is our last card. This is the tallest mountain I have ever climbed. This is the tallest mountain I have ever climbed. This is the tallest mountain I have ever climbed. This is the tallest mountain I have ever climbed. This is the tallest mountain I have ever climbed. This is the tallest mountain I have ever climbed. This is the tallest mountain I have ever climbed. Woo! <laughs> Nicely done. We did it. Woo! That was a lot of practice. <laughs> <laughs> that was a lot of practice. Well done. Yeah. Well done. We did these A cards. Yeah. And superlatives. Yeah. The top of the group. The top of the group. So good job, everyone. Well done. And I want to thank Ava and Larissa. Mwah. Thank you for your kind, kind support. They sent a super sticker. So I'm going to send them the cards. Okay. So if you want these cards, I can send them in, I, I send them to you in a PDF file. I, I have Larissa, I have Ava's email address, so it's gonna be real easy for me to send them the cards. If you want these cards, you have to send me a super sticker and your email address, so I can send you these cards through your email address. Okay, nicely done, everyone. Well, well done. So let's put these away. And we're going to do our next activity. Our next activity is Lolly's Revenge. Lolly's Revenge. Yes, yes. Lolly's Revenge is a conversation between two people. Yes, two people. They are, we have Joe and Sue. Joe and Sue. Yep. Yeah. And this is Joe. Please say hello to Joe. This is Sue. Say hello to Sue. Now, um, there are four steps. Step one, I will read the conversation. Step two, I will ask you questions about the conversation. Step three, we will read the conversation. And step four, we will shadow the conversation. So again, lots of practice. Oh, we got, we got a board here. I need erase the board. However, before I erase the board, I need to take a picture of the board. Yes, I do. So um, I, I will open my camera. There it is. I will step over here. I will take a picture of the whiteboard. <clears throat> here we go. Count down. Four, three, two, one. Okay, I got the picture. And then after today's lesson, I will upload it to my Facebook group page. So that way you could check it out anytime you want to. So I'm going to erase this whiteboard right here. So we for our next activity our next activity is lolly's revenge so and there are four steps okay okay the whiteboard is clean now for lolly's revenge we're doing lolly's revenge step one I'm going to read the conversation, all right? And then if you want me to read it again, you say OMT one more time. If you want me to go slower, read it slower, you say MS more slowly. Then if you're ready for question, no, 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 last time, right? The, the, you got it, just one more, the last time. LT last time, and then we go to step two. 
Step two um, is question time. I will question time. I have four questions. So you're from your listening, you're listening carefully, right? And now I'm going to quiz you, right? I'm going to give you some questions to check your comprehension, to check how well you listened, yeah? Then, and then step three, reading. Okay? So this way, you reading practice plus, you can, you can see the sentences. You can um, check your understanding, right? Because step one is listening. Step two is listening, right? You still haven't seen the sentences, right? Step three, we're going to read it. You will see the sentences, and you will understand more of the conversation. Then step four, shadow, shadowing. Okay, so that's speaking, right? So then we'll have speaking practice. So there's lots of good practice here. So step one is listening. Step two is comprehension check. How well did you listen? We're going to check that. Then step three is reading. So then you will understand more and you will have practice um, reading. And then step four, we will shadow. We will... Um, have speaking practice. Marcos, thank you, buddy. Mwah. Marcos, you got the cards. Yes. Do I have your email address, Marcos? Um, maybe I do. Maybe I don't. I'm not sure. But Marcos, um, you need. I need your email address. Marcos. Thank you, buddy. I appreciate it. Thank you for your kind support. Mwah. Thank you, Marcos. Thank you very, very much. And Marcos, I will send you these cards. I need your email address. Thanks so much. Yes, we got three people. Good, good. Thank you so much. Okay. Brilliant, Marcos. Yes, it's brilliant. <laughs> okay, let's do it. Okay, are you ready, Marcos? Are you ready for Lolly's Revenge? Yep. Here we go. Step number one. This is Joe. Please say hello to Joe. This is Sue. Please say hello to Sue. Hello, Sue. Hello, Joe. Okay, here we go. Conversation time. Oh, Joshi, here we go. Joshi, I'm about to start. Okay, so we are doing Lolly's Revenge right here. Step one, okay? Please listen carefully. Joe is first. I bought a brand new... No, no, no. Stop, stop. I wrote it. I read it wrong. Okay, here we go. One more time. I'm sorry. Five, four, three, two, one. I bought a new brand of cereal. Let me have a taste. What do you think of it? It's not as good as our usual cereal. Perhaps, but it has a lot less sugar than our usual cereal. However, taste is very important for me. I don't think the taste is significantly different than the other cereal. Well, that's your opinion. I'm sticking with the original cereal. In that case, we will buy two different cereals. That's fine with me. Okay, we're going to do it again. Yeah, one time's not enough. Okay, OMT, OMT. Here we go. Ste or this is Joe, OMT. I bought a new brand of cereal. Let me have a taste. What do you think of it? It's not as good as our usual cereal. Perhaps but it has a lot less sugar than our usual cereal. However, taste is very important for me. I don't think the taste is significantly different than the other cereals. Well, that's your opinion. I'm sticking with the original cereal. 
In that case, we will buy two different cereals. That's fine with me. Okay, Josh. OMT. Ha <laughs> ha, Helga. Helga is, she is understanding how she, Helga. You know Joe and Sue, don't you, Helga? Ha <laughs> ha. Okay, Larissa, OMTMS. Oh, Larissa, LTMS. Whoa, OMTMS, and then she went right to LT. Okay. Oh, hello, um, Geethan Gel. Whoa, Sleepwalker, LT. Whoa, Tomas, QT. You guys are, you guys are fast. Okay, here we go. Um, Larissa, OMTMS. Here we go. OMTMS. Okay, Tetsuo, OMT. Eva, okay. OMT, OMTMS. One more time, more slowly. I bought a new brand of cereal. Let me have a taste. What do you think of it? It's not as good as our usual cereal. Perhaps, but it has a lot less sugar than our usual cereal. However, taste is very important for me. I don't think the taste is significantly different than the other cereal. Well, that's your opinion. I'm sticking with the original cereal. In that case, we will buy two different cereals. That's fine with me. Oh, Tomas, nice. All right, Tomas. Well done. Your listening is getting better, huh, Tomas? Okay, JAMA, OMT. Okay. OMT. Let's do it. OMT. I bought a new brand of cereal. Let me have a taste. Okay, okay. Okay, Lolly, good. Okay. I think that's a good idea because I'm looking at the clock. So we're almost two hours already. Okay, so Lolly, L T M S M S M S. Okay, here we go. Last time, more slowly. Okay, Mary Poppins, L T. Okay, here we go. We're gonna do last time more slowly. Here we go. I bought a new brand of cereal. Let me have a taste. What do you think of it? It's not as good as our usual cereal. Perhaps, but it has a lot less sugar than our usual cereal. However, taste is very important for me. I don't think the taste is significantly different than the other cereal. Well, that's your opinion. I'm sticking with the original cereal. In that case, we will buy two different cereals. That's fine with me. <laughs> That's fine with me. Oh, Sleepwalker agrees with, with um, Joe. <laughs> I want to be like Tomas. So, Ava, I want to be like, to be. I want to be like Tomas. Okay, Ava, I want to be like Tomas. Oh, Josh says, um, yes, taste is important. Oh, Lolly, thank you. So, Lolly, stick with not very or deviate from. That's right. So, stay the course. 
Stay the same. Stick, stick with, stay the same. Don't change. Stick with, don't change. Stay the same. Stay with it. Don't change. Seo says, I recommend organic cereal for Sue and Joe. It makes them healthy. So it makes them healthy, Seo, healthy. Larissa, um, Lena, me too. Sugar is bad for our health. Larissa, sugar is bad for our health. Okay, Ava, I want to be like Tomas. Perfect. Okay, here we go. Question time. Here we go. Step two, everyone. Question time. Question number one. What did Joe buy? Oh, Marcos agrees with Sue. This is interesting. <laughs> Who agrees with Joe? Who agrees with Sue? Interesting. Deviate. Change. Josh, deviate, change, deviate from it, change. Go off course, deviate. Don't go straight. Oh, let's deviate. Question number one, what did Joe buy? Question number one, what did Joe buy? <laughs> Anytime, Larissa. You should... I eat oatmeal every morning, very healthy, no sugar. Um, lots of, I put, I put berries in my oatmeal. I put um, seeds. I put protein powder. I put, um, pro I put um, uh, uh, flax seed. Okay, question number one. He bought a new brand of cereal, Tetsuro, brand. Like, for example, Kalbi. So here in Japan, we have um, Kalbi potato chips, and um, there's another brand. So the maker, okay? So Tetsuro, brand, B-R-A-N-D, equals maker, okay? So like brand goods, right? For example, um, Louis Vuitton is a brand. Um, Gucci is a brand. Kellogg cereal is a brand. Quaker, Quaker is a brand. So Joe got a new brand of cereal. Marcos, perfect. Marion, Joe bought a new brand of cereal. Yes. Maya, uh, he bought a new brand of cereal. Yes. Larissa, Joe bought a new brand of cereal. Lolly, a new brand of cereal. Perfect. A new brand, a different maker, right? Brand equals maker, a different maker. So maybe it's the same type of cereal, but the maker is different, right? The cereal type is the same, but the, the maker is different. Um, Tomas says, can I write sort of instead of brand? No. So brand is the maker, okay? So brand is the maker. So you sort of equals, um, it, 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 it's similar. Sort of is similar, okay, Tomas? So, but Tomas got a new brand of similar cereal, okay? That, that's, that's good. That actually, that's correct. So Joe bought a new brand of similar cereal. A new brand of similar cereal. Okay, good, 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 good. Okay, question two, question two. What does Sue think of the new cereal? What does Sue think of the new cereal? What, question number two, what does Sue think of? of the new cereal. N no, 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 Tomas, that's fine. So um, similar cereal, right? So a, a, a different brand of similar cereal, right? It, it, 
It's like the same type of cereal, but a different brand. Okay, two, what does Sue think of the new cereal? Sleepwalker, Sue thinks it's not as good as their usual cereal. Yes. Yes, Lolly, it's not as good as their usual cereal. Yes. Ava says, sometimes it's not good to buy the new brand. <laughs> yeah, so like stick with, the, stick with the usual brand, the original brand. Yes, Tetsuro, she doesn't like the new one. Uh, Josh, Sue doesn't like it. No, Larissa, it's not as good. Wait, it's not... The taste, Larissa, the taste is not as good. All right, Larissa, the taste is not as good. The taste is not as good. Maya, uh, sort, uh, sort is like different sorts, apples, for example, I think. Um, so sort is, it's better to say um, type or kind. So, Maya, there are different kinds of apples, right? There's, there are like the Fuji apples, there's the, the sweet red apple, there's the, the granny green apple. So, there are different kinds of, of apples. Sort, so that w your SOR, that's like you're your sorting things. So, like, okay, here's the blue ones, the red ones. So, let's sort, let's say we have reds and blues mixed up. Let's sort the, let's, let's put the blues over here. Let's put the reds over there. So we have to sort the, the reds and the blues. So we have to separate them. So we're sorting. But um, sort of is, means like or similar to. Uh, the taste of the new, okay, Maya. The taste of the new brand of cereal seems to be not as good as the old one. Okay, good, Maya. Okay, here we, seems, okay, Maya, seems. The taste of the new brand of cereal seems to be not as good as the old one. Perf nice one. Good, good sentence, Maya. The usual, okay, Tomas, the usual cereal is better for soup. Yes. Larissa, the taste is not as good. Okay, good, Larissa. All right. Faha, the taste is not as good. Okay, um, Faha, the taste is not as good. The taste is not as good. Different kinds of apples. Yes, Maya, there are many different kinds of apples. Okay, uh, Ava is not the best as the old. It's not as good as the older cereal, Ava. It's not as good as, not older cereal, but it's better to say um, the, the usual or the, um, the old, yeah. Okay, we could say older. Well, not older because it means as the, the usual, right? So they usually always buy the same brand of cereal. But Joe found a new brand of similar cereal, okay? So the original cereal, they always buy the same original cereal. Okay, here we go. Question number three. Question number three. How is the new cereal different than their usual cereal? Yeah, Maya, seems. Okay, question number three. How is the new cereal different than their usual cereal? The test is not as good. Good. Abdella, yes. Good, good sentence. Hello, Hong. We're, we're almost, we're finishing up. You're super late. Okay, question number three. How is the new cereal different than their usual cereal? Question number three. How is the new cereal different 
than their usual cereal. Sayo. Yes, less sugar than usual. Yes. Okay, RSSB. It has less sugar. Perfect. All right, Muhammad. The, the taste is different than the usual one. Good, good. Lolly, it has a lot less sugar than the usual one. Good. Sleepwalker, the new cereal has a lot less sugar than the usual cereal. Perfect. Helga, less sugar. Yes. Ava, it has a lot less sugar. Good, 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 good. Okay. Um, Violet, the cereal contains less sugar. Very good. Very good. All right, everyone's got that. Marcos, the new cereal has a lot less sugar. Yes, perfect, perfect. Nice, nice. Okay, let's go. Question number four. Question number four. Last question. What did they decide to do? Question four. What did they decide to do? Marion, it has a lot less sugar than their usual cereal. Yes. Yeah, RS, RSSB. She liked the previous one. Okay, Maya says the new cereal is not as sweet as the old cereal because it has a lot less sugar. Nice sentence, Maya. Question number four, what, what did they decide to do? 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 <laughs> what did they what did they decide to do? Sleepwalker to buy two cereals. <laughs> Yes, Helga. Joe will buy two kinds of cereals. Yes. Larissa, they decided to take two kinds of... Buy, Larissa. They decided to buy two kinds of cereal or get, not take. They decided to get two kinds of cereal. That's hard, huh, Larissa? Take and get. It's different. But oh, that I'm going to... I'm going to put a memo. That's it. Let me get a pencil. That is, that, that's going to be a good discussion. Yeah, okay, I'm going to put, um, so, get versus take. Ooh, that, that, there's, that's hard because there are so many different situations, right? It's very hard to teach get and take because there are, oh, it, it's, so many, it depends on the situation, right? Nuances. It's almost like you have to be a native speaker to understand get and take. Oh, there's so many differences, right? So um, that was Larissa, right? Let me go back. Yeah. So Larissa said they decided to take two kinds of cereal. We don't say take. We say, you can say get, Right. Um, they decided to get two kinds of cereals, right? And or buy. But we can't say take. But please get that. Can I take one? Can I get one? So, ah, uh, wow, wow, wow. Yeah, they're, they're, it really depends on the situation, the context, what's happening. Uh, that, that's very hard to, very hard to teach, very hard to understand, right? So, get and take, it, it's very hard for me to teach that, and it's very hard for you to understand that. So, oh, okay. I'm going to try. I mean, for example, the best thing is just example, example, different situation, different situation. So, so you know, um, I, we do, we practice um, patterns and situations, right? So, we're gonna have to do that, so um, we're gonna we're gonna talk about that. We're going to talk about that 
another time. But I, I wrote a memo right here. Whew. It's hard. It's hard to teach. Okay. Um, here we go. Yeah. Abdella, I have... Well, I've been eating oatmeal every morning lately. Just oatmeal. But I put many different things in the oatmeal. Okay. So what did they decide to do? They decided to um, buy two different um, kinds of cereals. Yep. Okay. Let's take his, his theft. That's one situation, right? The 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 thief took my wallet right the thief um takes everyone's money right um but then you can say um get, yeah yeah I'm, we just have to use different um scenarios different different um situations right depending on depends what situation we use get which situation we use take so it all depends on the situation so it depends on the situation when we use get and take okay let's now we'll, i will think about that i will i will make i will make cards um we will make i will make a lolly's revenge so we will practice that um um soon okay Let's now, it's time for reading practice, okay? So I'm going to hold the conversation up to the camera. Let's read this together, okay? Wait, wait Marcos. Get and take is a topic for a whole lesson. Yeah, Marcos. It's like, even, it's not enough. One lesson is not enough time. Because it's just, oh, there's so many situations. And um, many question marks, lots of lots of um, nuances and like some situations either one is okay some situations only take some situations only get and some situations both are okay so that's ah it's so hard okay let's let's read it together okay here we go joe is first i bought a new brand of cereal let me have a taste. What do you think of it? It's not as good as our usual cereal. Perhaps, but it has a lot less sugar than our usual cereal. However, taste is very important for me. I don't think the taste is significantly different than the other cereal. Well, that's your opinion. I'm sticking with the original cereal. In that case, we will buy two different cereals. That's fine with me. That's fine with me. Okay, good, good, good. All right, let's read it again, okay? And I, I want you to read this with me, right? So for sure, I hope you are um, speaking with me. I hope you're, you're speaking with your voice. <laughs> okay, here we go, here we go. I bought a new brand of cereal. Let me have a taste. What do you think of it? It's not as good as our usual cereal, perhaps, but it has a lot less sugar than our usual cereal. However, taste is very important for me. I don't think the taste is significantly different than the other cereal. Well, that's your opinion. I'm sticking with the original cereal. In that case, we will buy two different cereals. That's fine with me. That's fine with me. Okay, good, good, good. All right. Now, it's shadowing time, everyone. Shadowing time. So let's say these sentences together. It's speaking time. Ready? Here we go. Shadowing. Five, four, three, two, one. Here we go. I bought a new brand of cereal. I bought a new brand of cereal. I bought a new brand of cereal. Let me have a taste. Let me have a taste. Let me have a taste. 
What do you think of it? What do you think of it? What do you think of it? Hmm, it's not as good as our usual cereal. It's not as good as our usual cereal. It's not as good as our usual cereal. Perhaps, but it has a lot less sugar than our usual cereal. Perhaps, but it has a lot less sugar than our usual cereal. Perhaps, but it has a lot less sugar than our usual cereal. However, taste is very important for me. However, taste is very important for me. However, taste is very important for me. I don't think the taste is significant significantly different than the other cereal. I don't think the taste is significantly different than the other cereal. I don't think the taste is significantly different than the other cereal. Well, that's your opinion. Well, that's your opinion. <laughs> well, that's your opinion. I'm sticking with the original cereal. I'm sticking with the original cereal. I'm sticking with the usual cereal. No, 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 original, sorry. I'm sticking with the original cereal. I'm sticking with the original cereal. I'm sticking with the original cereal. In that case, we will buy two different cereals. In that case, we will buy two different cereals. In that case, we will buy two different cereals. That's fine with me. <laughs> That's fine with me. That's fine with me. That's fine with me. <laughs> okay, let's look at it one more time. One more time. Okay, here we go. I bought a new brand of cereal. Let me have a taste. What do you think of it? It's not as good as our usual cereal. Perhaps, but it has a lot less sugar than our usual cereal. However, taste is very important for me. I don't think the taste is significantly different than the other cereal. Well, that's your opinion. I'm sticking with the original cereal. In that case, we will buy two different cereals. That's fine with me. That's fine with me. <laughs> okay. Yeah, then. Uh, Sue, has, Sue has else opinion than Joe has. What? Oh, oh, then. Wait, wait, Tomas, Sue has a different opinion than Joe has. Okay, Sue has a different opinion than Joe has, Tomas. Sue has a different, a different opinion than S Joe has. Oh, thank you. Okay, good job, everyone. Well, okay. I'm looking at the clock. We are over two hours. We did it. We did a lot today. Yeah, we did. We did um, which one doesn't belong. Yeah, right here we did, right? I gave you four things. You decided which one doesn't belong, and you said why. Then we did dictation cards. Yeah, and I have to thank Ava, Larissa, and Marcos. Yeah, and they're going to get the cards when it's because they sent me a, a super sticker. I'm going to send them the cards. Then we did Lolly's Revenge. So we did a lot today. I hope you enjoyed yourself. I had a good time because um, I'm here with you. So I enjoy this. I enjoy the time with you. So um, thank you for being here with me. I appreciate it. Um, thank you, Larissa. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Great, great, great. 
Finally, we climbed to the top of Everest. Not quite, Tetsuro. <laughs> Maybe Fuji. No, yeah. I want to go to, let's go to the top of Fuji. Let's climb Fuji, yeah. Um, all right, so thanks, everyone. I really appreciate it. Um, you see the green team. Come on, let's get some more green team members. Yes, yes, come on. Join the team. Um, read all about it. Hit the join button, and there will be a, 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 a drop-down menu, and it will um, tell you the different levels of membership, how to become a member, and the benefits of becoming a member. So please check that out. I also have a Patreon page where you can support me and the channel. And remember, by supporting me and the channel, I can support you, yeah? So help me so I can help you, all right? So we do this together. We're a community. Let's do this together. And also, I have a website, markkulik.com, with flashcards and worksheets that support my videos, right? So the worksheets and flashcards go with the videos. And I have some books, and I have coffee mug, which there's still coffee in here. Mm hmm Well, anyways, everything's in the descriptions below. So if you want to support me and the channel, um, go to the descriptions, and you can, um, there's links to those things. So anyways, thanks so much. You rock, Marcos. You're, you're the best, Marcos. Thanks so much. I wish... I, I, was, I wish you could be my dentist, Marcos. Um, I live in Japan. You live in Brazil. So it would be hard for, us, for me to go to your office, right? So, so I, I, would, I wish you were my dentist, for sure. Um, you seem like a very good dentist. We did Zoom meetings, right? And you seem like a, a, a great dentist anyway. So. But I'm in Japan. You're in Brazil. So that would be difficult. <laughs> okay. Well, um. I will be here tomorrow, everyone. I'll be here tomorrow, okay? So please come back tomorrow. I will be here tomorrow at 10 a.m. 10 a.m. on September 16th. September 16th, I will be here for you again, okay? So um, anyways, thanks so much. And let's say goodbye together, shall we? Yeah, okay, sounds good. Let's say... Goodbye to each other. Yes, Marcos, I, I would like you to be my dentist. So everyone in Brazil, please um, go to Marcos for your dental needs. <laughs> for your oral needs, please go to Marcos if you live in Brazil. <laughs> okay, let's count down to saying goodbye together, okay? Let's do this. Okay, here we go. Five, four, three, two, one. Mwah. Okay, thanks everyone. I really appreciate your kind support. Um, everyone, smile, be happy, stay healthy, and um, please come back tomorrow morning, okay? I'll be here tomorrow at 10 a.m. Japan time, okay? Check it out. Okay, thanks so much. Bye. See you. Bye.